Hello, I'm Roshni and we have um, Gabriel Abed, uh, the founder of Bit.com. Hello, Gabriel. Hello, Gabriel, Roshni. sorry. <laughs> How are you today? I'm great. How are you liking the event? The event's pretty good. Pretty it's, good? It's nice to see such a lively event, lots okay. of people. Uh, a great, a great subset of, of individuals from all walks of life. Okay. I've met some investors, people who run exchanges, people who own cryptocurrencies, uh, regulators, government officials. Okay. It's been a very good event thus far. Oh, that's lovely. Uh, so, uh, how do you think this, this event is? Uh, like, I mean, you've obviously been to so many events before, but with this year at this time, do you think we have advanced? from the last year events like I mean advanced in the sense that we make it more clear like do you think people have now gotten to know more about oh, blockchain and Bitcoin compared to last year or the year before that well in the previous years people were now educating themselves hmm, okay uh, this year you're seeing much more of an educated crowd okay. they're much more sophisticated on the topics of cryptocurrencies blockchain technology and Bitcoin All right, okay. and you're seeing much more discussions happen around the regulated uh, fields of this industry. All right. Okay. Okay. And and of course you are you are such a Bitcoin and blockchain lover. So what what would you like to share with our viewers about technology? I mean. Well, I just wish to remind our viewers that each and every one of us are here for one main reason. Yeah. And that's immutability mm -hmm. and the the inability to edit, destroy, or mute records. And because of that single reason around the security of that data, we have a disruption of trust. Yeah. And due to that, it's very important to remember that, that cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin are here to stay. Mm -hmm. They're the reason that we are here and everyone should uh, adopt such technologies. Okay. Everyone should have in their portfolio Bitcoin mm -hmm. and understand that mm -hmm. Uh, the future of, of financial systems, the future of uh, trust-based systems are going to be disrupted. Mm -hmm. And I think that's the main takeaway, yes, is that we have been saying it for years and we are seeing it now, yeah. more now than ever, yeah. and it's only yeah. going to escalate from here. So to our viewers, uh, buy Bitcoin. <laughs> Perfect short message, buy Bitcoin. Also just a casual question, um, I mean it doesn't have to be very, I mean, um, okay, so just a casual question basically. How do you think, I mean, or do you think we are lacking somewhere um, in terms of services or technology or operations, you know, to keep bad actors away? So do you think that's, that's one, like, one day is that just going to go away or it's inevitable? Bad actors will never go away. Unfortunately, okay. Whenever there's money, there's greed. Yeah. Wherever there's greed, uh, there's the there's the malicious and nefarious desires of man to All want right. to manipulate such systems. All right. Okay. And we're going to forever see that exist. All right. Okay. But this is where education, good regulation, and good actors rise to the top. Yeah. And yeah. I would say that the one main thing that is still needed is education. Yeah, education amongst the regulators, uh, proactiveness amongst the regulators, education amongst the community members, education amongst the non-community members. Yeah. And that is something that was needed 10 years ago, five years ago, and today. Yeah. And it's going to be something that's needed in five years. Absolutely. Because how do you avoid being burnt? Through education, yes. through knowledge, through experience. And that all boils down to one becoming uh, knowledgeable in these various aspects. As they say, do your own research, right? Do your own research. Yeah. Always, Always do your own research. Yeah. Don't trust anyone. Yeah. Don't trust me. Don't trust you. Yeah. Don't trust anyone in this crowd. Don't yeah. trust anyone on the internet. Don't trust. Yeah. We have mathematics for that. We have Bitcoin for that. Yeah. And at the end of the day, it requires you to educate yourself become knowledgeable on these subjects yep. and through that education and through that knowledge you'll be able to weather the storms navigate the bad actors and enter a place of good sustainability mm -hmm. and good outcomes yep absolutely it was lovely talking to you um i hope you enjoy your day and this event it was very nice meeting you as thank well you. thank you